Like most people, when I saw the Cybertruck unveil, I thought it was a sick joke. When the, the incident happened... Maybe that was a little too hard. <laughs> Let's just say I didn't think this would be a, a great product. However, my thinking started to change. I started to realize if I saw it on the streets, I would, yeah, I would start off being shocked like anyone would. And then I'd probably start thinking, that's sort of cool. I don't want a truck. I'm not gonna get one. Or am I? <laughs> no. And the problem is in Australia, it takes friggin' ages before we get the left-hand drive in Australia. So, I'm a pretty impatient guy, and I thought rather than wait, I could just make my own. Steel is not my medium, but clay and paper and cardboard. And it occurred to me, I'm gonna build my own Cybertruck out of cardboard. While I knew that would be great content, it would be even greater if I could drive it around. And then it occurred to me, We're doing this. Now, like Elon Musk, I have a flair for the dramatic. Here we go. It's time! Oh, sh what? There we go! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I bought a golf cart to make a Cybertruck with out of cardboard. I'm an adult. But before we get started, I have to give some massive credit. To a friend of mine. And that friend is Epidemic Sound with over 30,000 awesome music tracks that you can use for your creation and over 60,000 sound effects. On YouTube you can't use your favourite pop songs, you'll get copyright strike. With Epidemic all the licensing is completely automatic and synced up to your YouTube account. It also works with other social media platforms. I use Epidemic Sound for every video on this YouTube channel. I'm so excited they've sponsored this video and made this project possible. You can download the stems for any music track, meaning all of the individual parts that make the music track and just balance it or remove whatever you want. Nothing beats the quality of Epidemic, but there's, I mean, it's pointless me just saying that to you. Let me show you. Go check out Epidemic completely free for one month with the link in the description. And if you sign up using the code JAZZA, that one month turns into three. To get you started, Epidemic and I put an album together of my favorite epic art and montage time-lapse tracks. And we're even doing a competition with some great prizes, which I'll mention at the end of this video. So stay tuned for that. And a huge thank you to Epidemic for sponsoring this video and making this possible. This is gonna have as, as many features as the actual Cybertruck. Music, got a, got a pump and stereo system uh, that doesn't quite fit. It might need to be a passenger. It'll be more effective when um, it doesn't look like a golf cart. The plan is, I'm gonna put this here. You know what, let's just get rid of this thing now. <laughs> I shouldn't keep it rolling while I'm moving stuff. That's, that's a bad. I am a professional. Yeah, hang on. This place is full. Don't worry, I got it right here. Good thinking, Gareth. There we go. Let's just put this right here. How do you use these? Whoa! There's room for improvement. Ah, that's tightening it. Lefty Lucy! Nothing quite like doing the doing the hard work yourself by the sweat of your brow. Get, just like in the good old days. Ow! I just hit myself in the mouth. Okay, you ready? It's the moment of truth. Should have thought ahead about how I was going to remove this. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, no. Oh. My thinking is, I use a steel bar as like a main support over here. We're gonna have two three meter aluminum rods running down the length. We use those as the, like the core anchorage-ness. Before I do anything with cardboard, I'm gonna nail the frame. And then when that is done, then we do the cardboard. So, let the adventure begin. I actually think I'm probably gonna need a little bit of clearer lighting in here. So I'll just turn it from our cyberpunk theme into something a little more practical. 
All right, let's frame it. Just pausing for a sec, you can see the angle that we're going for here. The first panel will go down sideways and then I'm going to make a frame that just angles in very slightly. But I need to build that frame out of timber and uh, we're just a little thick in our timber. Nothing wrong with a bit of thickness, but for this case we need a bit of lightweightness as well. We actually ditched the steel, we're not using the steel because it's really hard to cut and drill into. So. Aluminium, aluminium, and we're going to get some light timber. Let's go to the hardware store. This is light. and screw this to aluminium. Make a good frame and staple cardboard to this. All right, let's go. I'll just, I'll just carry it. I don't need the trolley. Finally, I had my, my cyber truck to put these on. I'm trying to look man. I don't think that's particularly manly. Let's hit the road. This would feel way cooler in a cyber truck. Does that unnerve you when I use power tools? Look at that! Alright, and one bit at a time, I'm gonna build the rest of the frame, angling it a little bit using this timber, so we have something to uh, stick the cardboard to. Let's get to work. This is where I'm at at the moment. You can see the frame starting to come together. These are just in place temporarily because I need to figure out the angle. Too high and it's gonna look just ridiculous. But too low and I'll have no headroom. How do I? <laughs> so, as you can see, without a sunroof, I'm gonna be pretty much this. All right, let's just see what it looks like with a higher angle. Obviously everything's held by clamps, so this is likely to fall apart any second now. Oh no, the clamp came undone. Gareth, quick. Got the film and, and clamp at the same time. Clamp like you'll never clamp before. That's better. I think I can make this work. Back to the montage. We're actually at a place now where we can start to put on the exterior, which I'm pretty excited about. The windows may not be uh, t Tesla, uh, t what are the, what are the uh, armor glass. We're just gonna use a fly screen, but that'll be good because that'll substitute for air conditioning. Get a nice breeze. Hopefully things will start moving a bit quicker now because it's been about eight hours. <laughs> We're staying late tonight. Sorry, Gareth.
And now, to foil. We set out to create a vehicle inspired by, indeed, derivative of the Tesla Cybertruck, but in our endeavors, we stumbled across a design entirely unique. It's time for the golf courses of the world to wake up and make a move now to sustainable energy. I'm pretty, for sure, this I'm pretty sure the, the golf carts already run on batteries. But aren't there like a couple that... No, no, they're all batteries. Even so, uh, it's time for them to at least adopt some style notes. Introducing Jazz's Cyberbug. excited to share with you today the cyberbug the cyberbug is bound to turn some heads on the golf course when I created the cyberbug I wanted to make something that was not only sustainable but something that would change the way people saw golf buggies that meant making something functional beautiful and stylistic and also durable Here we have your average pickup truck door. Let's give it a give it a big old bash, shall we? <laughs> look at look at this went through rent were chip weak and ch crap. Let's give that another one just to make just to prove a point. The Cyberbug with its unique exoskeleton is designed to absorb any hits that come its way. <sighs> Not a scratch. So how about you're on the golf course and you bring your valuables with you. What happens if someone sees some of your valuables in there and they want to take it for themselves? Lob a brick at your window, huh? Oh my fucking God. Is room for improvement? <laughs> we need to contextualize that because people are going to think, oh, that's just a crap window. No, if it were any other window, just go straight through. The Cyberbug has state of the art electronics all throughout and on top of that it's a quick charge with a simple plug simply grab your patented cyberbug power thing plug it into plug it into your wall this one plug charges the whole cyberbug including the stereo and maintains the battery and the lights speaking of the sound system here you can see in the bug bed state of the art stereo system so you can pump your cyberpunk tunes and let people know who's really got the style around here you can't get past something as revolutionary as the doors. That's right, I'm sure you've heard about falcon wing doors before, but what I'm sure you haven't heard about are penguin wing doors. That's right, falcon, penguin. Stay the art right there. And you can even fit it in a cameraman as well. Come on, buddy. Come on. Yeah, no, come on, there's room in here. Come on. In. Uh, uh, come on. You, you got this. I'm stuck on something. You got this sweet white dashboard but you can't guess what material that's made of people first thing people say is marble wrong it's, a, it's sort of it's a form of paper so now this presentation at the end of the day is all talk and what really matters is how this thing functions on the green and to get to the green you're legally allowed to drive on the road if you win within two kilometers of the golf course you know what that means. We're gonna go out, we're gonna pump some cyberpunk tunes and just get a feel for how much of a head turner this thing really is. Now, speaking of pumping tunes, remember how this video is sponsored by Epidemic Sound? Well, they put together a bit of a competition that we're running so you can win some epic prizes. So to enter, first things first, go down and claim your Epidemic free trial one month plus with my code, that's three months of free Epidemic Sound. You can cancel at any time. Then go check out the album we made together of my favorite tunes. Pick one that you love and make an 
artwork or some sort of creation to that music. And then submit on the official submission page. The link is in the description. And of course, while you're at it, share it with me in the community. Use the hashtag Jazzajam. That way I can see it and the community can see it. But to actually enter, you need to make sure to enter via the official link in the description. Five runner-ups will receive one year of free Epidemic Sound membership and an item of their choosing from the Jazza Studios shop. And then one lucky grand prize winner will win a GoPro Hero 8 along with one year of Epidemic Sound and an item of their choosing from the jazzastudios.com shop. All the details for the competition I mentioned are in the description, so go check them out. But for now, it's actually time to take this thing on the road and uh, I'm gonna be pumping some of those epic tunes while we're going. Out we go into the wild. Oh my goodness, this is this is an experience. I am definitely very cool. I am a cool person in this car. Oh yeah. It's the Cyberbug. Who's up for a round of golf? Hang on. You feel like golfing? Let's go play some golf. Here's the drop. Oh, there's potholes! Oh no, there's potholes! We've hit some construction! Oh boy! Lucky this thing can off-road like a mother I must look so cool! I think I... I think I look mega cool. This is how you make an entrance to the golf course. The music starts. Look at all these buggies. They all look the same. Boring! It's time for innovation! Sustainability and change! Oh yeah! Look at this, this is what you will look like in your cyber truck, parked in a car park. Who's oh, up for a round of golf? Ooh, strong westerly winds. It's gonna be hard to hit against. There we go. Oh, not bad, not bad. Three's all right. I think, um, unfortunately, the only thing I actually didn't consider with this thing is making it uh, weatherproof. The wind in my hair is very cool, but I think it's about to rain any second now, which means it's a great time to wrap up this video. I want to thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, please, for the love of God, hit that like button and share it because a lot of effort went into this. I want to thank my team for making this possible, sourcing a freaking golf cart and all the materials. There was a lot of effort that went into this and this was a really fun project. So I sincerely hope you enjoyed it. Please, if you did, make sure to subscribe for more fun with art and creativity and memes. Oh, and Elon, if you're watching, Tesla's my first uh, stock. I have Tesla ston stonks. Please, Elon, tweet this. It will make my life complete. <laughs> Make sure to check out the other videos on my channel. You can see one over there. There's also a vlog behind the scenes of this one. And go check out my vlog channel. Otherwise, once again, subscribe. Uh, I'm off. Let's head out in style. <laughs>